Hi, I am DVS and you are watching Sander Web YouTube channel. In this video, we will learn how to set chart dynamically. Whenever you get a data from the database and that data will show on your chart as a dynamically. So how is it possible? So keep watching this video till the end and you will see how we will set chart as a dynamically. Here, before we are going for a coding, let's see the output first, right? Now here you can see the all the data dynamically came from the database. I also show you this output. Now whenever my page is reload at that time I get the data from the database. For that I simply made one Ajax call. So here you can see the Ajax call data. Now here you have to see this JSON response. This JSON data get the data from the database. Now how to possible this dynamic AM chart. Now we need to follow this my whole block. Now I will explain or how it will work right. Now we need to follow these steps right. Now step 1 is what you need to create a one division inside your some file which you have to create it like a, suppose I create a one file like a chart.php or suppose I create a one file like home.php here we are using coding editor framework so that's why i create a one file inside my view folder so here i create a one file like a chart.view inside this file i copy paste this division which i already mentioned here right now second step is what you need to add css and javascript library for chart you simply copy paste this code into your file I also same code I already copy pasted right now now simply third step is what now you need to get data from the database now how is it possible I simply made one function so if you are using a simple PHP then you have to write this simple Ajax call right suppose I copy paste this code in my file also so here you can also see this code now now I explain this Ajax call now simply what I am doing right now now I using a coding editor framework that's why I call my controller and inside this controller I get the data from the database so here if you are using simple PHP, then you have, you need to create one file like uh, getData.php. You don't need to create uh, this function, uh, controller and function name. Now I also open this controller. I am using a coding editor framework. That's why I create this function inside this controller. Now controller will call model file now here open my model file if you are using simple php then you don't need to create this all this file you simply now simply open this chart model now here what i am doing right now now whenever my ajax call will run at that time this function will call by using this function I simply get the data from the table and here you can set your column name your first column name is category second one is value so this is not a mandatory but for easy to set up your chart 
that's why i use category and value as my alias name so simply what i am doing simply get the data from the table and this data i will return to ajax call by using json encode so whenever my ajax call will run that uh, all the data fetch from the table and send to the ajax response like this by using json encode now now here you can see my ajax call will run after the response will come now here here you can see now whenever i reload my page you can see this function will call and here you can see my response like this right how to set this response into the chart now step by step we'll see how this response will set up on our chart now you need to go to your view page inside this response now response this dot status it means what if data is found it means we will send status is equal to true so here i set uh, one condition like is equal to is equal to true now we created one division with id dynamic chart so before we set up in or set the data on chart we simply remove all the previous data or previous chart data so whenever you reload it will remove all the old data now here you can see inside this id we added one division with id chart div now now this code you can easy to copy paste this code also now here you can see this is a static data which i commented but now we need to set dynamic data now how is it possible now create a one array like a chart data now response dot data in my response you can see here here you can see my response like this category value category value now you need to see inside the data this my all the json data available so how i will access this by using for each response dot data and push this response inside this category and value so my follow will run and one by one pass this all the data on chart like this response dot data and then category now here you must have to remember you whenever you set up uh, or deal with a value or integer or float value you must have to pass int if you are not using this then you will not showing this value because i am getting this error so i fix it out with this pass int right because here you can see the value like this but this type of value not supported in am chart that's why i am using pass int now simply now rest of coding is same here you can see now i finally pass this dynamical data into x axis and series data so once you have to complete this code or you can see the output of this chart like this right so this is a easiest way to create a dynamic chart now if whenever you use some another demo 
for that you need to pass data dynamically by using this way if you have any query or if you have any question regarding this dynamic chart setup so you must have to comment us in our comment section and uh, i hope okay, you will get idea or suppose if you are using some another language like uh, php core php or asp.net or maybe some another so simply you must have to remember here how dynamically pass the data this is the logic actually and rest of will be same so i hope okay, you will understand everything and i hope uh, you will set up your uh, am chart on your website and i i extremely expect it you will commenting or you will subscribe our channel because uh, you are developer also and we are also developer and i hope ke okay, you commenting first and then subscribers so i waiting for your comments and if you are doing this uh, demo or if you are doing this uh, uh, chat on your website then please let me know how or you can share your website url so i can also see your uh, chat and everything so thanks for watching and don't forget to subscribe our channel